Hello friends, this is Uts, and as I'm sure you've heard by now, the Legion got quite a few nice buffs in the latest DBD update. The most remarkable one is that if they manage to chain together 4 Feral Frenzy hits, the 5th one will now instantly down any survivor, even healthy ones, and this is something that's really hard to avoid. Even if you have borrowed time, they can just hit you another time and you'll go down right after, so it's something that you really want to avoid. Consider, for example, the background footage that you're seeing right now. This is a game that's not going super well for me, but one of the survivors makes the mistake of mending right next to me. And then I can take that third hit and now go back to the person dying on the hook. Someone comes for the rescue and that person doesn't have the deep wound timer, so I can hit them and then hit them again. And now from this point, I've turned the game completely around. This really adds a lot of depth uh, to playing as and against Legion. But it also reminds me of another character that they buffed in the past that wasn't even that strong, but for some reason they really thought they overdid it and they immediately went back and nerfed it again, and I don't want to see that repeated again. So, before Legion stumps all the new players and people don't understand, I want to do my part to avoid that. I'm going to teach you how to counter this in a number of ways. The first one, and the most obvious, is to simply prevent it. Uh, you should never mend during the Legion's frenzy. That's the mistake that you saw made in that clip. If you mend, the Legion can hit you a second time and then keep going, and this can very quickly spiral out of control. Do not mend, or at least 99 your mending, until the Legion is done with the frenzy. The other common sense strategy is to simply split up from your team. Never have three or let alone four people all together in one area. As you can see, me and this other survivor are really close together, but as long as we run in opposite directions, Legion will have a really hard time catching up without some really, really good add-ons. So that alone can help you. In a more desperate situation where the Legion already has several hits and you're afraid that you're going to go down to it, you can try to dead heart through one of their Feral Frenzy slashes. But be warned, if they start the slash from too close, you'll still get hit and some Legions are not stupid and they'll see it coming. Uh, a more common idea often is to try to hit him with a pallet stun. And this can work if you do stun him, that will end for sure the frenzy and maybe save you and your team, but it is a little bit hard sometimes, so it's not the most reliable. Try to get as far as possible before you do this as a final resort, as it's not super, super consistent. Another cheeky strategy that you can try is to vault a very safe pallet or window and then pre-blind them as they follow you. This will pull them right out of frenzy and they can do a basic attack, so watch out, but it should be able to save you from the deadly fifth hit. If you're one of the early survivors hit by Deep Wound, you can actually run ahead of Legion and try to body block in tight areas for your teammates. If the Legion hits you again, that will end their power, so it's a very, very annoying thing that you can try to do to get in their way, and survivors that are smart will constantly try to do this. Do watch out though, because if the Legion just hits you, then they can go right through you, because for the first few seconds after a hit, you have no collision with them. But one way to avoid this collision issue and completely body block a lesion is to reach a really safe pallet or window and just vault it back and forth right after you get hit. If you do this at a pallet, the lesion literally cannot get past it if you spam it well enough and they'll have to find another way and you can buy a lot of time for your teammates. On a window, this same trick will not work forever, it will eventually get blocked, but a survivor on the other side will gain invaluable time, so you can buy a lot of time for them to run away so that Legion runs out of their power. Quickly going into a locker can work against a Legion that's a bit desperate or a bit new, but a smart Legion will just wait it out and grab you right out of it. However, if there is a person ready to body block for you, you could go into a locker while someone else that is out of the Indipo and simply stands in front of it. And at that point, the Legion can literally do nothing. If they hit the person, they lose their power. If they just wait it out, they're going to run out of it. So wait until they exhaust their power and then come out and whoever is healthy can body block for the other person, ideally. And with that, now you have a collection of nice tricks that you can do against Legion to avoid that fateful fifth hit that will put you down. So yeah, please don't get him nerfed. Thank you so much and see ya.